So then my friends, hopefully now you feel a bit more confident with Tailwind and maybe you'll start using it in your own projects. There is also a lot more that we can do with Tailwind 2. I've not covered absolutely everything in this series. That would take about 100 videos. But hopefully now you're in a good position to go out and check the documentation and learn more yourself. It's really clear and simple to understand and it gives you a lot of code examples too. Now, I may also do Tailwind stuff in the future, maybe with Vue or React or something else too. So keep your eyes peeled for those. So then, my friends, I really, really hope you've enjoyed this series. And if you have enjoyed it, please don't forget to share, subscribe and like. That really means a lot and it helps out an enormous amount. And if you do want to join the cause and support the channel, you can do by clicking the join button on the channel homepage or underneath the video right down below. You also get a little cool ninja badge next to your name in the comments for that. And it's 99 pence or cents per month. And I've also created several premium in-depth courses on Udemy. So the first one is Modern JavaScript. The second one is D3 and Firebase. And the third one is Vue.js and Firebase. So if you want to take one of those, all the links with the discounts automatically applied to them are going to be in the video description down below. So again, thanks so much for watching. And I'm going to see you in the very next course.